What's up everyone, this is David Hoffman from David's Been Here, coming at you from super noisy Miami, Florida, my hometown. I'm back here at Bombay Dal Bar, and this is the final entry of my seven Indian dishes you must try. This is the mixed tandoor. What is a tandoor? Well, a tandoor is the clay oven. This is a staple in Indian cuisine. This is where all the breads are made. Well, most of them, and then they also make fish, chicken, lamb, paneer. They do everything in the clay oven. It comes out incredible after it's baked. Literally all falls apart in your mouth like butter. So let's go into Bombay Dal Bar, let's go to the kitchen, and let's see how they make all these meats. Let's go. The goal of this series is to educate you guys about Indian cuisine and show you the process of what goes into making these dishes while also supporting local businesses during these tough times. A recent survey found that 95% of businesses have been impacted by the pandemic and 39% said they would be unlikely to survive without further government assistance unless sales go back to normal. President Biden has pushed the American Rescue Plan to help revitalize small businesses and supplement their lost income. But there are things you and I can do to help too, like being mindful of where you shop and supporting small businesses and local restaurants like Bombay Dabar. Going? Ready? All right, guys, we are back in the kitchen and we're going straight to the tandoor. My friend. Hey, man. Hey, man. You're hardly working or working hard? <laughs> What's up, guys? What's up? How you doing? Everything good? Oh, you have all the meats here. Look at this. Okay, so what are we gonna, what are you gonna do, my man? Yeah, so we are gonna do. All right, let's cut. We just get a shot here, really fast. Give me marker. Clap. And, all right, clap, clap. All right, so right here we have chicken wing tandoor, right? So this is one of the places I've seen it done. It's really, really hard to come by in most Indian restaurants, but chicken wing tandoor is amazing. It's marinated with yogurt right here. Look at this, beautiful. Oh, nice and charred. This is so buttery. Ready? You're gonna help us today? Yes. Awesome. So my friend, this chef is gonna help us today. So basically everything's already marinated. We just have to put it on a skewer and then throw it into the tandoor. And the tandoor is right behind me, right? So this gets up to like 500 degrees. This is crazy hot. Literally, put your arm over it. Oh, you can't even put it. Oh, too hot, too hot. And over here we have all the breads, right? So we're doing garlic naan, basically a lot of garlic naan. Garlic naan all day here. All right, here we go, here we go. Awesome, so this is the mixed tandoor. It looks freaking good. So, so what do we have in there? What do we have? We have the tikka. So chicken tikka? Yeah. And uh, tandoori chicken. Tandoori chicken? Perfect. All right, so he's gonna put it on the skewer now. This is the main thing, right? Yeah. So, and it's not a kebab. Don't ever call this a kebab. Kebab is when it's like a sea kebab, right? It's usually like minced meat is, is a kebab. Let me get on this side, hold on a sec. Ready. Oh yeah, look at that, looks so good. Okay, this looks so phenomenal. Mm -hmm. There we go. So how long do you let it sit there for? It's taking like five minutes. Five minutes, that's it? Yeah, five minutes. Five minutes and it's ready to eat. So next up he's gonna make the shrimp tandoor. Shrimp tandoor is one of the best seafood, oh, the best shrimp seafood of all time. Or the best shrimp you can ever eat in your life. Right? <laughs> Where'd he go? Where'd he go? There he is. There he is. Look at this. So, ah, so you're gonna marinate it. Perfect. Okay, so this is super fresh shrimp. It hasn't been marinated yet, right? So he's gonna marinate it and then he's gonna put it on. Oh, you already have it marinated there. Okay, perfect. Okay, okay. So he's gonna mix it, right? So he has the marination and then he has the shrimp right next to it. Okay, perfect. So he's mixing the shrimp with the marination and he's gonna put it on the skewer. Oh, 
Awesome. Okay, and then straight back into the oven. You like taking the oven? Oh, open it one more time? Oh, sorry. All right, close it. So how long is it going to take? This one coming eight minutes. Eight, eight minutes? minutes? Okay, so it's another eight minutes for the shrimp to be ready. Chicken probably would be ready sooner. And now we're going to go over here to the breads and put this into the oven. This is the best. This is why non bread is so good because of this clay oven, the staple of Indian cuisine right here. Okay, perfect. So yeah, we'll do the, the bread really fast. Ali. Ali. A L I. Yes. Ali. And, and then. The other guy is Rock. Rock. Rocky. 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 Yeah, like, rock star. Ro like the Rock? The Rock? Rock star. Rock star. Okay, okay. <laughs> perfect. All right, so he's starting from scratch. I love this bread. Awesome, that's one. Got the first one in. Perfect. So he has to slap it around like that, right? Flatten it a little better. Then he puts it on his pillow. And then from there it goes straight into the oven. How hot it is. Perfect. No, no, no. No, it's okay, it's okay. Sorry. It's okay. It's part of being in the kitchen, right? Sorry. Poor lens, right? Poor camera. So we're gonna put it. Alright, ready right there, go. So we got all plain, right? Got it. All right, the first one's ready. Awesome. Mm -hmm. They're so fast, like two minutes each, right? Yeah, this one is like one more. Yeah, this is the best part about the clay oven is how fast everything cooks. It's amazing. Uh, dude, it's it's 500 degree oven. It's way too hot. And then he puts it down. He like lowers it so it gets a little crispier. Like it literally gets a little hotter, right? Yeah. All right, so. So you need to make the garlic, right? And I mean, we don't have to. I think this is good enough. Maybe one garlic naan. Okay. So Did I cook it? Oh, okay. So right here, what he's doing is he's putting ghee, right? Or just butter? All right, this is gonna be good. This is what you need for every single creamy dish. Some nice naan. He's, he added ghee, clarified butter. It's the best. Is that for me? Yeah, this is for you. That took my bread, dude. It's taking my bread. What are you doing? This is for you. No problem. Let me see right there, sir. Right. Uh, right. And the garlic are also. Garlic. The garlic. So right here is making the garlic naan. So we got a bunch of plain, but we're gonna get two garlic naans because you the garlic naan is the best naan. Yeah. So garlic and cilantro on top always. Wow. 
Wow, it's perfect. And so we're almost done. The only thing we're waiting for is a shrimp. He said two more minutes and it's ready. It is gonna be mouth-watering. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at that. So he puts it down. Wow. Okay, same thing, ghee. So right there, he's putting ghee, clarified butter. Done. Okay. So that's that's good. Everything's good. This is the grated paneer and the mixed the some. Mm -hmm. it's so they make, it looks like a dumpling and then and then they roll it out again. It's amazing. It's actually. You need to roll it. So. Yeah, yeah. It's basically a stuffed naan. Yes. Yeah, so this is a very very different type of naan. This is sorry. Yeah, this is a very very different type of naan. So it's paneer naan. So it's like a stuffed naan. Stuffed is so good. Like. You're gonna make one for us too? Okay. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. So again, so this is a stuffed naan. So stuffed naan, basically for me, it reminds me of like a pizza. That's the best comparison because it is nice and, you know, the bread is nice and crispy, right? A little smoky, but then it's stuffed with cheese. This one is cheese. This is cheese, right? Yeah. Cottage yeah, cheese. Ready. Grated and uh, spices some. Cilantro spices. Perfect. Mix. Yeah, so it's cilantro, it's paneer. What else paneer is it? And uh, spices. And, and spices. spices. Yeah, it has to have spices, right? Mm. Oh, yes. This is going to go straight in my belly. Right? This one is ready. Wow. Look at that. Alright. The shrimp is almost ready? Yeah. Funny, I thought it was going to be the one with the least content. There's the one with the most. <laughs> Alright, so. Oh, you're gonna mix? Oh, you're gonna mix it in with this. Alright, so cool. Lemon juice, cilantro, little bit of spices, Indian spices. So, what are you doing there? And the butter, we need to mix the sauce. Okay. So, this is basically this is a masala for the mixed grill. This one also masala in there. So, it's basically like cilantro and then a few different gravies mixed, and then they throw in the mixed grill into it yeah. and it becomes even more creamy. Mm -hmm. So it's like a, almost like a roast, right? Yeah, yeah. This is the roast chicken. And then mix it. This part that you need to do. Yeah. So. Okay, onions, bell pepper, and then you put all that here. Let me get this side. Ready. Yeah, so he mixes it very nicely. And this is more of like, they call this like a dry masala, right? Yeah. Basically like a roast. A roast. Ready, nice. Six, nice bread. Oh yeah, that's good. So yeah, so same good. thing for the grill, for the mix. Yeah, yeah. So we separate it a little bit. You don't mix the shrimp with the chicken directly, if, but then we do on the plate, right? If the only shrimp, so we'll mix the different. Oh, okay. Okay. Perfect. All right. And that's it, my friends. We saw how everything was made. Oh, we're actually missing one thing. Okay, so one sec. And that is it for our mixed grill tandoor. We saw how chicken, mixed chicken was made, right? We saw how the shrimp was made, and then we saw also how they made the bread, the naan. So we did three different naans. We did garlic, we did plain, and we also did stuffed naan, which is paneer naan, so it's cheese naan. Oh, I cannot wait. Everything made in this clay oven is the best. The tandoor is the king, right? Yeah, thank you, Ali. Thank you, Ali, thank you. Awesome. All right, guys, let's go home, let's eat. Ali, go.
Come guys, guys. To them and take, take this. <laughs> <laughs> what does he have? Oh my god. I'm gonna cook myself here, bro. All right, my friends, we are back with the Mix Tandoor, the Tandoori oven, the clay oven, the most amazing thing ever invented. And I want to just clarify this debate because people have hated on me when I said about Persian Empire, and it says here online in like 50 different websites that a Tandoori cooking is believed to have originated during the Persian Empire and has been adopted in most of Central Asia, but obviously in India, it's different. It's just more amazing in India. They just do way more stuff with it. And obviously the marination that goes into each meat is different. All right, so let's open this up, right? Go. So what do we got? Well, we got a mix, right? I got some chicken tikka. I think this tandoor chicken here, which is, you know, bone in. And then here we have the shrimp. Beautiful shrimp. I'll take two of these. This is so good, look at that nice and rich okay guys and and this time we're not gonna just do regular naan we're gonna do what do we got here we have a stuffed naan right so this one has paneer stuffed naan so stuffed so good all right so stuffed naan this is actually very very different it's almost like a pizza so i'll just eat this alone mm -hmm. mm. basically like a pizza bianca Mm-hmm. Mmm. Feels like a pizza. Obviously, Martinian style tandoor. That breaking. Mmm. So it's not as crispy as the other ones. It's a little more doughy. But this is what I can't wait to try. Look at that. How incredible this is. Oh, those are the tail. I heard that if they don't have a tail, you shouldn't eat it. Mmm, that marinade, that yogurt, dahi always makes everything better. And the tandoor, the smokiness, the charredness, I mean, it just falls apart. And here, look, this is how I do it. Just break up the chicken. So you just get into this chicken, just break it apart. So you can mix this with anything, but here I'm gonna mix it with the stuffed naan. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm. That's extra tasty. Mmm. Smoke. So tender. Wow, this time I'm gonna get the naan and the shrimp together like that. Oh yeah, look at that big shrimp. It's a massive shrimp. Now I wanna settle this debate. Is it prawn or is it shrimp? Or is it both? Mm. You have no idea. Succulent, chunky shrimp. It literally is like butter, but that's what the tandoor oven does. It literally just bakes everything, it makes it fall apart, and that smokiness is nothing. There's no other way to compare it to anything because it's just unique. Mm hmm. Mm. The shrimp. Mm. Wow. They also do paneer, like big paneer tea cats, what they call it. They put it in the tandoor, so it's on a skewer, like that. It doesn't fall apart, doesn't like melt because the paneer, you know, that cottage cheese is more dense. It's not like just like oozing out. Mmm. The marinade. Sorry, the marinade on this chicken, so good. Not too spicy, just the way I like it. Wow. I'll say though, the star here, ah, I was gonna say the shrimp, but I'll say the stuffed naan. Stuffed naan. Can't go wrong with it. Mm -hmm. And yeah, try to do it the way I'm doing it, even though I'm making a mess right now. Mmm. <laughs> oh, wow. Anything from the tandoor. Smoky. Delicious. Charred. Damn. Chicken. Shrimp. Paneer, bread. I mean, you can't go wrong. Everything go in there. So good, very, very satisfying. If you're not into meat, again, you do the paneer. And if you're into meat, do everything else, right? Cheers, guys. Love you. Mmm. That's it. It's too good. I mean, oh, with the paneer, none. Well, so guys, I hope you enjoyed this series. Seven different dishes. What do we do? Butter chicken, 
chicken tikka masala, lamb vindaloo, goa fish curry, right? Malai kofta, saag paneer, and then we ended it all off with a mixed tandoor. And we saw how everything was made, the process, and just the enjoyability of Indian cuisine. You will never get bored of Indian cuisine. It is freaking fantastic. I'm gonna start my own Indian restaurant here in Miami. So I'm gonna show everybody in this world what Indian food's all about. Oh, I'm feeling a little bit of spice. All right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below. Subscribe to my channel for more awesome travel content. I'll see you in the next travel food adventure. Oh man, maybe Dubai? I'm done. <laughs>